All right, here's a, a tougher kind of question to solve for a certain uh, letter. So we start with Q is equal to P over the square root of P squared plus 1. And I have to solve for P. Now I've got two P's, so I'm going to have to do some factoring uh, eventually. But first off, let's get rid of this uh, square root thing on the bottom. I wonder if I should do that first. Yeah, let's multiply both sides by that. Lots of ways to do it. P squared plus 1, P squared plus 1. So these cancel out. So I'm left with um, Q times the square root of P squared plus 1 is equal to P. I'm okay there now. Um, now, let's get rid of the square root so I can square everything. So I'm going to square this and square this and square this. So I'll be left with Q squared times, now on this side, the square and the square root cancel. So it'd be P squared plus 1 is equal to P squared. Now, hmm, why don't I multiply the Q squared through? So it'll be Q squared times P squared plus Q squared is equal to p squared. Now let's move this to the other side. <coughs> so it'll be q squared is equal to um, p squared minus q squared p squared. Ah. Now here's the p's together so I can factor the p squared out. So factor p squared out left with one minus q squared is equal to q squared And then uh, um, I'll divide both sides by 1 minus q squared. So q squared over 1 minus q squared is equal to p squared. Almost there. And now I can square root both sides. Square root this, square root this. So on the right side, I'm just left with a p, which is what I'm looking for. And on the left side, I'd have the square root of q squared over the square root of 1 minus q squared. And so p is equal to, the square root of q squared is just q over the square root of 1 minus q squared. And that's probably where I'd, I'd stop. You could rationalize that denominator, but I'd probably stop right there. That's a tough one.